So what we're going to talk about now is the connection points to our anchors. So I have an anchor set up here. Uh, you can connect rope, webbing, or what I have here is an anchor strap or anchor sling. This particular one is a padded sling where the gray part is padded, the yellow part is the sling part. Okay. So when we talk about connections around the anchor, we have the anchor here. What we do for rescue is we go around the anchor and marry the two ends together. We call this the basket hitch or the basket uh, formation or configuration. This is going to be the strongest. What we will stay away from and we will not do is the choke configuration or the girth configuration where you put the eye through and put it through. We're going to stay away from that for, for the rescue side. We want to basket hitch it at all costs. Okay. If you do need to shorten it down, you can make a round turn around it if you have to, to shorten it up even like so. But it's still a round turn with the basket hitch. Okay. So then you'll connect your carabiner in and your friction device or your haul system and you're ready to go. Now you'll notice here on the carabiner how it's pulling along the spine. Carabiners are made two directions of pull along the spine. You don't want them to pull across. So let's just say that our anchor is a wide diameter anchor, bigger diameter anchor. So we'll use these two posts here, but it'll be like going around one big anchor here. Okay. So what that does, it has a tendency to what we call split this carabiner on a different axis, not along the spine, but it's actually pulling on this way towards me and this way towards that anchor. So to eliminate that situation, what we like to do is take the carabiner out and we're going to use what we call a delta link or tri-link. So you can put the delta link in and this one here is just a screw lock. So you put your ends of the rescue strap in, tighten it down, and you see with the delta link it can be pulled in three directions. Towards the load right here and on each leg of a wide diameter anchor. 